Hey guys, I'm Greg with the Fix My Bleep channel. Thanks so much for joining me today. So on this video, I've got Thor's hammer along with the base. So this is a prop that I bought off Amazon and I've done a couple of pretty good modifications on this thing. You guys can do these same modifications to your own prop and so be sure and like and subscribe. It really helps out my new channel. So let's get to the video. Let me show you what I've done and you guys can do this at home for your own movie theaters, for your own office if you just want to show this thing off. So let's check it out. Let's get to the video. All right, you guys, just going to go over a couple of quick things about the LED lights I used in this hammer's base. So right now I've got it set to kind of a deep red, just give that kind of a lava uh, look effect on the base. So with these lights, uh, I'm just controlling them off my phone, so they're just a wireless light set. And you can control the light intensity, so I can uh, kind of dim these lights down if you don't want them super bright. As you see, I'm dimming them all the way down to where they're just really faded. And you can just barely see the lava effect now. You can bring them all the way back up. You can change your lighting color. Change it to kind of a almost a white cross color there. You can change it to kind of a blue. Change it to more of a green or whatever. The cool thing about these lights um, you can go into the functions and we can go in and we can set it to like a seven color crossfade and then we can also control the speed with which this uh, fades to different colors as well. And for that lightning effect, which I thought was kind of cool, I set it to blue strobe for that lightning effect. So you have all sorts of different effects. And set it to a seven color strobe, give you a seizure white strobe there's that blue strobe purple there's what your yellow looks like Anyway, you have all these awesome functions. You can set this up on a timer as well. And here's what the app actually looks like on the phone. I don't know if you can see that, if it'll focus. Just super easy to set up. You can group these as well. All right, you guys, so when you order this prop, you have the option of ordering just the hammer or the hammer with the base. So obviously, where I've got the Avengers Theater room that I built myself, had to get the hammer with the base. So it was cool and all, I got the hammer, got the base, you can set it down flat, hammer goes into the base, looks really cool. But I was like, all right, you know, this is neat and all, but how cool would it be to actually have the hammer and the base stuck, you know, into one of the walls? And so I mounted the base up onto the wall, and then I was like, okay, that's cool and all, but how do I get the hammer to stick into the base? Earth magnets. So Got a super powerful earth magnet, stuck it into the base, screwed it in there, screwed one into the hammer very carefully. I didn't want to ruin the hammer, and so check it out.
Now everybody that comes over, if they're worthy, they can pull it right out of the base. Prop instantly improved. All right, so when you guys buy the hammer and base, this is what you get. And this is what your base looks like. Pre-modified condition. And then let's see the base after it has been modified. Oh, uh, look at that. Kind of the lava rock effect. And obviously it's got the uh, heavy earth magnet in the base. And if you look carefully, you can see where the wire goes in the bottom of the base right here. And I've got that actually down in through my drywall. And it goes down into a plug there at the bottom. I've got it wired down uh, into the uh, outlet there. Pull the hammer out. There are the earth magnets that hold the hammer in place. So for this base, I actually put in three earth magnets and they are linked in the description there. And this base was a little trickier. So it's a heavy plastic base. So it did not, it was not hollow when I ordered it. It took a lot of work. And if you look carefully, I actually, a couple of different size drill bits, totally busted through it on purpose to give it that lava rock look. Because otherwise, the plastic was so thick that as I was testing it, I realized if I didn't bust through it in a few places, you couldn't see the lighting effect. I could put lights in there all day long and they just would not show through. Be sure and cut a nice hole in the bottom somewhere where it's not very obvious to run your uh, light your power cable through. All right, you guys, so as promised, your wireless light set. These are your LED lights uh, made by Netlux. Um, they're just a little wireless LED light set and just get them off Amazon or Newegg and they do run off Android, they run off your iPhone and this is what I put in the hammer's base. Super easy to set up, really easy to use and very reliable. I've used them all in the theater room and uh, on a lot of my other uh, items that I've set up here. And there's another video right here that shows you all about these little lights. So check these out and uh, these are great. All right, you guys, so the only modification I had to make on this whole hammer was right here. So check it out. The end of the hammer just added one of the rare earth magnets and that little magnet holds this five pound hammer up onto that wall base. So if you're gonna be mounting this thing onto the wall in a theater room or just to show it off and uh, still wanna be able to pull it out of the base, that's all you do, two little screws. You won't ruin the hammer, still has a great look on this thing. Looks awesome and uh, that way people can still just pull it right out of the base, provided they're worthy. And uh, that's all there is to it, so check it out. There you go. All right, you guys, so I've got a lot of other awesome videos just like this that I'm working on, so be sure and like and subscribe to the channel. Check out these other awesome videos for right now, and hey, I'll catch you later.